With these high numbers, one local teacher has a message for school districts that aren't enforcing a mask mandate. I was fine, but I did not want to be in the position of spreading it to a student or to a family member of a student. That was Boyle County teacher and Fayette County School Board Chair Tyler Murphy. Last month, he tested positive for COVID-19 despite being fully vaccinated. He's been getting tested on a routine basis because of the contagious Delta variant and tells LEX 18's Austin Pollock he's glad he's been wearing a mask in the classroom to protect his students and their families. In tonight's Big Story at 6. <laughs> Boyle County teacher Tyler Murphy is well liked. Now this is what we started talking about last time. It's clear his high school seniors seem to think that. But like other Kentuckians, I was someone who was fully vaccinated who tested positive. It's true. It can still happen. Given how contagious the Delta variant is, people who are vaccinated can still test positive for COVID-19. I was surprised uh, on the one hand. On the other hand, given uh, the information that we know and that we learn about the Delta variant, um, you know, I also I wasn't surprised. Surprised because he didn't have any you symptoms. Have Perhaps being fully vaccinated contributed to that. Even if. Uh, someone experiences a breakthrough infection, uh, it prevents serious symptoms. But not surprised because experts say the Delta variant is more contagious than earlier forms of the virus. He tells me why he chooses to get routine tests. Making sure that I was protecting folks around me, protecting uh, members of my family who weren't able, aren't able to be vaccinated yet or who are immunocompromised. As we continue to fight this global pandemic, Murphy says his test and wearing his mask kept him from potentially exposing other people. But for the positive test, I would never have known uh, that I was positive. As a teacher, he wears a mask in the classroom, as do his students. Health officials say wearing a mask can help keep the virus from spreading. According to the CDC, guidance suggests universal indoor masking for all teachers, staff, students, and visitors to K-12 schools, regardless of vaccination status. Local health leaders also agree that masking can limit the spread, especially in a school setting. If he's not wearing that mask and the students are not wearing a mask, potentially how many people is he exposing if he's not wearing this? Oh, it could be a lot of people. And that's the same way with the general public too. If you've got a positive case, they're in a workplace, there's no social distancing. There's no mask wearing when needed, those type of things. It can spread just like that as well as it can with kids in school. In Boyle County, Austin Pollock, LEX 18 News.